do you know the right way to request a quote? Whether you're conducting a B2B or a B2C transaction, it's important you know how to request a quote. A good quote breaks down how much a service or product will cost. This breakdown is an important and necessary part of doing business. You want to look out for thorough quotes that detail the cost of labor and materials before you write any checks. With some larger scale B2B transactions, the purchaser holds the quote power in the sense that they should have knowledge about what they're looking for and submit a request for a quote, or FRQ, and then compare responses they get from various businesses. I'm Noel with JotForm. And stick around because today's video will be all about requesting quotes the right way. Let's go. First things first, you have to know what you want. You'll be able to create the best quote possible if you know as much as possible about the specific product or service you're looking for. Figure out your precise specifications of what you want to build or have a provider deliver. You should also know the precise number of each item or service you need. Itemized costs from a vendor makes it easier to compare quotes between them. Be exact with what you want and don't worry if you're requesting too much or something not doable. Soon after, you'll receive your quote responses. If they're all saying the same thing, that your quote is too ambitious, then you'll have a better idea of which vendors are a good fit. If a vendor can't do what you need, it's okay. The bidders who can deliver won't be scared off by your aggressive deadlines. Once you have responses back to your quote request, the discussion begins. What they respond with is a good gauge of the estimates for their final price. That is if the manufacturer's price is firm and delivery costs have already been considered. There could be some legitimate reasons as to why the initially quoted price ends up varying from the final price. Here's why. Your final price shouldn't be too far off from the initial quote given to you, but it can vary, especially for construction projects. Since no one is a fortune teller, there is the possibility of unknown circumstances playing a part. Whether that's new construction, renovation, or expansion projects along the way. Let's say your job request entailed materials such as lumber and plumbing parts. Unfortunately, these costs can fluctuate. Perhaps when you got your initial estimate, costs were lower but by the time the order was placed, the costs had gone up. Another factor is you changing your mind. It wouldn't be the first time mid-project that a customer decided to make a change like upgrading the mechanical systems from the original order. So how exactly do you create a quote the right way? First, ask detailed questions. This will help you whittle down your potential list of vendors really fast. Some, regardless of their opening price, just won't be qualified or a good fit for your specific job. Your bid should include these three pieces. Specify the quality of the parts or components needed for your job. You may have specific requirements like required energy efficiency or length of warranty. State your requirements for delivery. This includes your completion date for the project as well as any intermittent deadlines you may have. Last, state the terms you're comfortable with offering or put the ball in their court and simply ask for their payment terms. When creating your quote request, you'll also want to list any certain specifications of the bidders themselves. This could look like certain types of experiences, if they're bonded for specific purposes, have certain licenses, etc. If you're working with a big company on a massively scaled project, or are a government agency hiring for massive infrastructure projects, a highly structured process makes sense. However, this can differ if you're working with smaller companies on a much smaller scale and with a much smaller budget. This is where JotForm's free templates for quotes come in handy. If you want to request quotes for products or services, you can easily customize a form to fit your needs. And whether you're sending a quote request or offering services yourself, JotForm quote templates can be used. When it comes to quote requests, the main point is to gather a wide response from competent bidders who compete to win your business. With these tips, you'll be creating quote requests the right way in no time. Let's review. These are the basic elements of a quote request. Ask detailed questions. Specify the quality of parts or services needed. State your delivery requirements. State the payment terms you're offering and any specifications necessary. And that's it. It's smooth quoting from here on out. I'm Noel with JotForm. See you next time.